Hello, chess friends. This is Coach ND. Today we talk about 5334, and this is week 95, uh, page number 297 to 298, and problem 1435 to 1446. Okay, so here we are black, and um, yeah, let's turn on the timer. Start. So the biggest problem for this one actually is I could not let him go in here. Then going over, yeah, black going up. Okay, so I flipped it down, black going up, white going down. And uh, if he's running out, then there's no way to checkmate him. Okay, so so basically I have to give him the queen, rule him back. Okay, so give him a check, queen. I got look at this, look at this, pawn got, oh, sorry, pawn got in this. So he had to take. Now we will just take by the knight. That's a mate, actually, because the pawn got look at this, the pawn look at this, oh, sorry, wrong one. And <laughs> not pawn look at this, knight got in this, pawn look at this, and knight did a check. Okay, so that's a mate. Um, yeah, let's move on. The second one. Uh, let's set the timer. Start. Okay, this one white king is here. Now the g5 cannot get open. So that's a big problem. So I cannot use the rook check. And um, going here is not very good. After pawn takes, still the g5. g5 can open, but it will not be made. Now one thing is uh, here. A pawn is guarding this and this. The square not guard is this light square. So that means I have to I should not let him getting out from that square. So I should do this check. Yep. And uh, look at that square. So he had to take, no choice. Then we will push pawn. Yeah, we are not using the rook, we are using the pawn doing the check. And the big guy in this. That's a mate. Yeah, it's kind of like smothering mate because his piece are blocking the king. <laughs> Okay, this position actually you should see this is a white pawn, this is a white pawn, so white piece cannot come over at all. Now, what we have, we have this bishop, we have the knight, we have another bit, we have this pawn, pawn protect the bishop. Now the king has one square to go. I'd like to control that square. Yeah, I have a check, but he will go there and I could not do anything because uh, taking a g3 pawn is not good, f2 will take. So basically we'll take this pawn, I'll take this pawn, we will start checkmate here. There's no other way to stop that. Uh, the only thing he can do is take me, but then we will move the knight. Now I open the diagonal for my bishop, and knight is doing the check, that's a mate.
Okay, so here we have a bishop guarding this. So the king is stuck. If I can do this check, that's good, but knight is there defending it. So basically I have to rule away that knight. How do I rule away that knight? I have to make a threat to try to mate. Okay, of course if you take me, we'll go here mate. Now if you not take me, the only way to stop this, yeah, moving bishop is useless, do other things useless. The only way to stop us is push pawn. But we can take the pawn check. That's also a mate. Next one. So here, white king, white king is here. I have a queen. I have a knight. I have a bishop. I have a rook. I have two pawns. Now, first thing we can see if we take this, he take it back, and we go here is a mate. Of course, there's another choice to take the uh, take uh, my queen is this way, but we still go there as a mate. So take a pawn take. We go there. That's a mate because our bishop. I got in this. Okay, so now if we take with king, that's simple. It will come over with mate. Oh, I got in this. And number six. Okay, I have a knight, I have a rook, I have a queen. If I can go here, check, look like a mate, but there's a bishop guarding that. So basically I have to lure away the bishop. How do I lure away the bishop? Here we have to give away the queen. We'll do this check. And after bit take, bishop is blocking the king. Now knight f2 is mate, open the line for our rook. Okay. Next page, page 298. First one, we are white. Oh, we are sorry, we are black. We have oh, s let let's start timer actually. Why well, start talking? Start timer. Start. Start. Okay, so the white king is here. I have a rook guarding the top. Now I have a queen and a knight. Yeah, this rook is useless because that rook didn't clear. You cannot use this rook. Okay, so I have a pawn. So I'd like to my knight jump here. So I will give him a queen. Check. He had to take with the rook because pawn is protect the queen king cannot take so you have to take with the rook now you see this 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 plus the bottom so the king is totally covered knight jump over mate next one so the second start
Okay, this one we definitely cannot let this king go in back. After king go back, then he's free to go. Okay, so that means we have to lure him over, make him come in over more. Queen take check. Had to take because we got in this, got this. So he had to take. Now we will do a bishop check on this dark square diagonal. Our knight is guarding this and this. This knight guarding this. That's actually you don't need a knight guarding those. Pawn guarding those. Yeah. So this is a mate. Next one. Okay, this one white king is here, it's already totally stuck, okay, our bishop guarding this, this is guarding here, now I cannot go this way check because queen can take me, so I will go here check, yeah, I have two pawns, after knight take, one pawn take the back, that's a mate, uh, actually this pawn take the back, that's a mate, because this pawn need guarding that, okay, the bear guarding this. I'm not sure 30 seconds is useful or not, or maybe it's too long. This one I have rook, bishop, and a queen. The king is on the corner by her, s by king is a male, right? By himself. Okay, so we have this three piece. Now, of course, I need, uh, if I can go this check, it's good. So I have to give him a queen, lure him up, down. If he take, we'll do this check because we're guarding this as a mate. Now, if he not take me with the king, Take me with the pawns and the diagonal gets open. It will be the opera mate. Okay, we are almost done. Start. Okay, this one, yeah, first I thought we cannot let him go back here, so I'm thinking maybe I should give him the queen. But after he take, we had my check, right? I don't have any check. Yeah, knight check is useless. Okay, so I should not use give up the queen. Here, actually I saw this kind of problem a couple of days ago. Very similar position, not very similar position, very similar idea. So basically I will do knight check here. I'm guarding that. Now cannot run away from f3. So he had to take me. After he take, now I have another piece guarding f file. Then we will push pawn mate. Yeah, m uh, my, the game I come across actually has very similar idea. Okay, so give up a piece, open the line, then using a pawn to do the mate. Okay, so last one.
Okay, this one I had a rook and two bishop, couple pawns. And uh, of course, the bishop look at this. The pawn is blocking me, and this bishop got in this diagonal. So I will give him a rook check. Pawn had to take me. There are no choice. Now the rook can see the h2 square. So this pawn push is a mate. Yeah, two bishops are both scarred. Okay, so that's it. Yeah, not hard still. This is a uh, black to move mating too. It's still easy. We have two more weeks. Yeah, and 1470 is the start of the hard part. Okay, so far, yeah, we have two more weeks black to move. Okay, thank you for watching, and uh, I see you next week.